Hello and welcome to Let's Play The Sims 4 Boston Legacy and today we are starting our legacy challenge with the first founder Fiona Boston and she is a red hat <laughs> she loves red as obvious and as the rule says we can choose any season what we want so let's dive in shall we let's get a cute portrait for Fiona Boston because that will be what we will see in the world edit map and I actually hate the loading screen but as I have top-notch computer I don't care about it and we choose spring because we will have three more seasons and I changed the length of the seasons for 14 days so we have plenty of time until we uh, celebrate new year and I couldn't decide on any world so I went with the new cast and I chose twin oracle point and we are starting right now and we are in the lot that we will use for 10 generations and as the rule says we have to use two cheats in the very first part which is testing cheats true or on no on because it was true in the sims 3 and just own in the sims 4 and we have to just get 1800 simoleons in total in the very first part and since we cannot spend this money on so many things like into big helm I want to use the cheat let's call it cheated with making the roof on the ground so that we can put furniture under the roof onto the floor so that we can use it with that just a single door and the game will not count is as a room so that we will win <laughs> I suppose I know I am cheating I might be cheating I don't know I might be cheating I feel like I'm cheating but hey I don't care the, at the end it will float our boat and right off the bat I try to choose a single bat but the thing that actually came with the author with it and later add on added to the base game bat is the very good example for the starter time the starter times I guess we, we can call it starter times because we just have one person in our household and the fact that I hate the mailbox in this lot because it's far up on the edge edge so I always struggle to find it and I put an easel maybe we can paint some paintings and we can sell it and so that we can earn some money right off the bat and I am <laughs> painting the roof actually to make it a bit better and oh I didn't know there was bees whatever and as the first thing that Fiona does I made her to paint and later on I try to find some maybe what is that obelisk I don't know let's call it stones I try to find some stones that uh, Fiona can dig and some buried treasures like this one and so that Fiona digs and maybe find some some things cool like a time capsule like a, what is that fossil and such that so that she can earn money without even trying and so it is a good start in my opinion I don't know I always played with the legacy challenge but it was off camera and I also didn't follow the exact rules and Right now, we are looking for fo fox, fox, not fox, frogs, because when we mate frogs with the other frogs, then 
we can sell the offspring and we can earn more money and I love the details like these ones so much in the sims 4 because we can earn money without even trying so much too much or even working out no not working out working in a job as a job I don't know English is my not first language and right now we are waiting for the Fiona to sell her masterpiece and actually we are following Fiona because she is going to dig the first stone <laughs> I I just love how this game works and I usually play on the fastest mode in the Sims 4 because it is much easier not to follow but to get along no not get along get forward let's call it get forward I really do not know that okay so <laughs> she is looking for her second frog in the day and the first frog is dirt surfer frog and the second frog is eggplant world frog and we can make them like no let's make bleed because we are American yeah so we made dirt surfer and the uh, eggplant world frog and sell sold the offspring which is another dirt surfer frog well this game does this so many times and the third frog is stripped leaf frog and we are heading back to do sell to the masterpiece <laughs> we call it masterpiece okay it is masterpiece please please it is masterpiece we can you cannot convince me otherwise and right now we are hunting for the man because we need to start our legacy but before hunting for man we just need to create another painting so that we can earn some money and right now we are searching for a bit more stones and something like that but we cannot find right off the bat let's continue our manhunt and there are two men one is Mortimer God and uh, it's Carlos something something I forgot her his name and we want to meet Carlos first and if we click right off the bat we can make him our baby daddy and our first goal is to get pregnant because until the heir is born and become a child we cannot work but the thing is we can get married but we cannot get money by marrying a person so that we can just paint or plant to get money and I cut to this scene because we have tried so many people but nobody responded positively so we just <laughs> will focus on paintings and I want to end the parts when the Fiona sleeps this indicates that there will be so many episodes for the legacy challenge until we get the 10th generation and every episode will contain just one day with every episode we are going to try to get pregnant and to reach our second generation when we reach our second generation we will focus on the air and there are some rules to choose the heirs so we will talk about it, the rules in the second par part and the night is on and we have to conclude our part we have done two paintings and we met so many men but we couldn't get pregnant in the first try see you in the next video we are approaching to the end and if you somewhat enjoyed the video please consider giving a thumbs up leave a comment subscribing love you all thank you for watching peace out